Without further ado, the Harper Avery for Surgical Innovation goes to Dr. Meredith Gray. on her behalf, Dr. Jackson Avery. Thank you. Incredible. Knowing very well that she might win tonight, Dr. Gray opted to stay in Seattle. A trauma came in and she knew that she was the right doctor for the job. That's one of the many reasons that I'm so very, very proud to call her my colleague and my friend. Now, Dr. Gray has experienced more loss in her life than I think most of us would deemed fair. She lost her little sister, Lexi Gray, who I know would love to be here tonight with us. She lost her husband, Dr. Derek Shepard, who knew with total certainty that this night would happen. And she also lost her mother, Dr. Ellis Gray, who won this award twice, once as a resident, and probably would have won a few more if she hadn't been taken from all of us so young. The most amazing thing about Meredith, though, is that she takes all that pain, all that loss, and she turns it into drive. Drive to save lives, to make things better. And despite all that she's lost, she continued to find joy in her work as a surgeon, as a teacher, as a mother. And she managed to share that joy through her spirit of discovery and of possibility and of hope right in the face of darkness. I am profoundly grateful for the lessons that I have learned from Meredith Gray. And it is my distinct honor to accept this award on her behalf. Congrats, Meredith. I'm so tired, I can't feel my teeth. I almost stitched my finger to a person. <laughs> Scrams. Yeah, you heard her scram. This is our beach. We are forced to acknowledge that certain kinds of magic exist. Oh, Ooh, look who's calling. Uh-oh. <laughs> hey, you're just in time for the champagne. Ready, wait for it. Woo! <laughs> yes, yes. What'd she say? Yes, she asked me if I feel different. Damn straight she does. And that history and memory and the ghosts of our past are sometimes just as tangible as anything we can hold in our hands.